up guys, Sick Crazy here. Today I'm bringing you guys a Defender Team Deathmatch gameplay and it's going to be High School Stories episode, I think, 19. Um, let me just double check on that. Um, that'll be real quick. So, uh, anyway, today I'm just going to talk about... Um, oh, sorry, I lost my train of thought. Oh, today I'm going to be talking about the uh, Skittles incident. Which was uh, kind of funny. Um, now, Phil wanted me to call it the ball tap incident, but I didn't think it was a good idea. Or something along the lines, or, or like, uh, like balls and skittles or something like that. But I thought it would just be easier to just call it the skittle story. Um, but this is also how he got our whole table in trouble. So, um, for the last couple weeks, now I'm not involved in this, but for the last couple weeks, um, Phil... Bobby, I think Pat and and I don't know maybe Dwayne or Shamar or Eric. These are, I know you don't know all these people. I'll explain that who they are in a second. Have been involved involved in a ball tapping war. Now my mom didn't know what ball tapping was, so I'm just gonna explain what ball tapping is in case some of you guys don't know. It's getting punched in the balls. Um. Now, <clears throat> so I don't know who's all involved in it, but. I knew Bobby and Phil are the two main people involved in it. So I offered a truce to Bobby, which he denied, to make sure I wouldn't get ball tapped. And he, um, he denied it at first, and then uh, he said, only if you agree to team up with me on something. I was like, all right, I guess. This is, this is kind of like not, it's not verbatim. It's like, we, we kind of just... Like, you could tell he said, like, eh, I want you to team up with me real quick. Now, Bobby and I have had our tensions in the past. Bobby and I absolutely hated each other in the past. We still kind of don't get along, but um, I kind of we kind of just tolerate each other. Um, but anyway, sorry, I forgot to go into it. But my at my lunch table, it's Dwayne, which is willful, as you guys know. Um, I'm going around the table from where I, I used to sit next to Dwayne, but after the whole incident with him, I moved over to the other side of the table. Um, then it's Eric, Phil, and I sit between Phil and Bobby, which even though I said I can't stand Bobby, but uh, I can, it's not, not that I can't stand him, I kind of just tolerate him. Anyway, I sit between Phil and Bobby, and then Pat and Shamar. Um, so, anyway, like I said, they've been having like a ball tapping war, and... I offered to have a truce, and he said, and it was kind of also like a, a peace offering, like to kind of end the tension between him and I. I was like, "All right, Bobby, I, I just want to call it a truce." I, I think I said something like that, um, and he kind of gave, denied it, and, get, and then gave me a look like, "Well, team up with me, then." And I was like, "All right, you can be like that." So I knew it was kind of um, not gonna end well. But I just, he said, wait, actually, Mike, I'll take you up on that truce. And I was like, um, give me a second. And I think I went to go talk to one of my friends. Then I came back, he stuck his hand out, to off, he offered me a handshake, and I accepted, shook his hand, and as I was pulling my hand away, he ball-tapped Phil, and Phil was like, oh! That's pretty much the exact noise he made except a lot louder um so anyway phil was like screaming how bad it hurt and i'm just sitting there laughing um pat was laughing eric was laughing shamar wasn't there and i think Dwayne was laughing and um yeah so anyway we're sitting there cracking up out of, and then um i'm gonna give a little bit of a backstory for this next part um so every week a teacher goes around and assigns cleaners for the week and it's always one table so that teacher's always mr w now mr w does not like our table because of the last time we got asked to clean the cafeteria so whatever um, anyway he um, he's walking by and phil throws skittles at bobby and then Mr. W turns around and says, uh, or he looks right at Phil and says, "You did not just do that right in front of me." And Phil go Phil didn't say anything, and he goes, "Why did you do that?" And then Phil goes, "I got hit," 
and you could hear the frustration in his voice. And then his face is all red, and it looks like he's crying. It was really funny. And um, Bobby and I start dying even harder. Uh, Eric starts laughing even harder. Pat, everybody started laughing even harder. Um, and then he gave the teacher and Phil gave us nasty looks, and I kind of calmed down for a second. And then he said, "You know what? Your whole table's cleaning the cafeteria next week." <laughs> and that just made me. I lost it. I I completely started dying laughing. Um, I was just frustrated that we have to clean again. Um, but it was kind of my fault, and it was kind of Phil's fault, and and it was really Phil and Bobby's fault. But I kind of take some of the blame for it because I was basically laughing, laughing in Mr. W's face. Um, and Mr. W is the teacher I talked about in an earlier video. Uh, I think it was Shadows Chokes. Um, where, like, we, he says, Phil says stuff about prosthetic legs and stuff like that. Um, so, yeah, that's Mr. W. We don't like him. For, uh, I'll explain what kind of happened with the previous cleaning thing. So, we didn't clean the right way, apparently. Um, apparently, Pat, or Spartan, as you guys know him, walking up to him, asking what we should do, was basically a felony in his book. Um, he... He basically looked at us and treated us like we were criminals, and we didn't take too kindly to that. Um, he was yelling at us, calling us retarded, calling us a bunch of names, and Phil and I were kind of looked at each other, and then afterwards we talked about it, and we were like, well, he's, what, like 60-something, late 50s, early 60s, and um, he would say, I was like, something along the lines of, um, he sh he's like 60 and he talks to us like that, and you think, you'd think a teacher would be more mature, and Phil kind of agreed, but didn't really say much, because you could tell he was frustrated, and, uh, so ever since we haven't really liked him, uh, I don't really, I'm not really gonna hold a grudge, um, I, from what I've heard, he's an awesome teacher, and he probably just got frustrated, because a lot of people didn't show up, um, but yeah, he went he went on a rampage, and then, so he doesn't like our table. Our table doesn't like him. So that's kind of the backstory on that. And then, the Skittles thing, of course, doesn't help. So it was pretty funny though that we have to clean next week. Um, next week's a short week anyway. We have off on Monday because remember I go to a Catholic school and Monday is immaculate conception. Yeah, immaculate conception. I couldn't think it was if it was Our Lady. Of, yeah, never mind. It's religious stuff. You guys probably don't care about. But um. Yeah, so uh, in my next video, probably tomorrow's video, I will be explaining some tension between Dwayne and I and some tension between Bobby and I. Um, now, the tension between Bobby and I has kind of been resolved. Uh, between Dwayne and I, it's getting worse and worse. Um, I just have lost so much respect for him after the fight, um, which I also have something to speak about. Um, oh, turned on shadows. One second, guys. Alright guys, I'm back. I'm, I realized I used the gameplay I used in Thanksgiving in football. So that's going to do it for this video, guys. Comment, like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, be now, subscribe below. As always, guys, this has been Sick Crazy. Yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next